lip was all yellow. It's your boy, Markatron3000. I'm here with Matt. He's looking through his binoculars. We've arrived at Mark Leaves Farm in Weymouth in Dorset. We've got the tents erected. Matt's bought himself a new tent after he ditched the last one at the last campsite because he couldn't get the pop out to pop back in. I've got my tent erected. It was pretty pain free. And I've found a little camping chair that someone's donated to us as well. So it's all good. We're right next to Chesil Beach. This is Chesil Beach and we've got Weymouth town in the background. This is what we call the Jurassic Coast. Back in the day, approximately 200 million years ago, this place was covered in dinosaurs. There was dinosaurs all over this beach and probably all over these fields. And there's still dinosaur fossils buried under the sand to this day. So if we're lucky, we might find some dinosaur bones while we're here. You never know. We can but try. It's quarter five. We've got here quite late. It took about four hours, 15 on National Express from Plymouth to get here. So I'm not sure what we're going to get done today. We might have a little wander into Weymouth and just have a little explore. Go and see the Portland Bill Lighthouse, which I believe is the twin of the Smeaton's Tower in Plymouth. It looks the same anyway. So yeah. This is the farm campsite, Mark Leaves Farm, and we've got the hookup. Look, we finally got the connector we need. You can see by the charging leads that we don't mess with anything shorter than 1.5 meters. And to be honest with you, we don't take no ears, lips, or assholes. You can see this is a real working farm with the caravan and campsite attached. It's also got a guest house as well in the main building. Check it out. Just gonna go up and say hello to the horses. All right, boy. All right, there, horsey people. How are you doing? Look at him in it. Some cock on him. Yeah, I think I'm gonna continue with my Cornish dialect phrases because I learned a few and I like using them. I'm not sure how compatible they are with Dorset, general Dorset speak, but I don't think that really matters. I'm going to keep doing it. Yeah, this is a bit different apart from the resorts, which we stayed at, at the Lizard, because this is like a campsite, you know, this isn't like a holiday camp with bingo and a turn on every night like that place was. This is cool, yeah, this is more chill, I think. Matt's having a little nap in his uh, new tent. I think we should have a walk down the beach and go see Portland Bill and see if we can find any dinosaur fossils. How far away is Portland Bill? Just up the, up the beach. And then I'll have a pub lunch. On the Portland, yeah, yeah. Yeah, I found out this place was on that show, Four in a Bed, you know, where people go and stay at each other's establishments and rate them i think they won it back in 2015 the woman that runs it was telling me every time they repeat the show she gets loads of weirdos ringing her up you know admirers and stuff i like, want to talk to her and like she gets some real freaks yeah put your trousers on mate not that warm as it's getting quite windy in it i'll just been up to see the horses as well we're going to go for a walk along Chesil Beach where the dinosaurs used to roam free and we're going to go and see the Portland and see the Portland Bill Lighthouse, that's what we're doing now. Come as on Matthew! Yeah, so we left the urban landscape of Plymouth and now we're back in the uh, countryside with all the animals. Totally palatial. Shut that gate and keep it shut. Randy Bullock in here. Go Randy Bullock in top field. Nice black and white horse here. Is it a mare? I think it might be a mare. Weird, isn't it? How the beach is kind of cut off. There's like water that's come in and separated it from the land. So I don't know how we actually get onto the beach. We'll figure it out. 
And you might remember from the Four in a Bed show, if you watched it, the llamas. These are actual, the people that run this place are traditional Dorset llama farmers. Are the llamas or alpacas? Alpacas or llamas, what's the difference? If anyone knows, let me know. Tell me in the comments, what are these creatures? Hurry, boy. Hurry, bird. And these shacks on the beach are weird, aren't they? What are they used for, I wonder? By fishermen or just people who live in them or, or what? I don't know. Are we supposed to walk down here, maybe? We're supposed to walk down this path? Or down here? Or some little boats down here? I think we should walk down the path map, we might see some more animals. I think some more animals in the fields up there. Are you mad? Bird. Bird. Mad. Made. Made. Bird. Oh. We're in the bush now. A bit overgrown that section. Looks like we found what looks like an old bunker. Let's go and check it out. Whoa, nearly slipped, nearly slipped, nearly slipped. I don't know how we get inside it. Ah! Whoa! <laughs> nearly fell, almost. Nah, I don't know if you can get inside it or not. You wanna come down this bit, Matt? Matt wants to look for dino dinosaur fossils, but he ain't got a chisel. He needs to, a chisel to chisel at the chisel. Chisel Beach. Jurassic Coast. It's a bit muddy down this bit, isn't it? Yeah. What we come down here for? We're sinking into this ground here a bit. A bit squidgy. Bladderack. Bladderack. The one with the little bladders in. Little... What's the type of seaweed? Balloons, yeah. Are you gonna crack it open and see if there's any dinosaur, dinosaur fossils in there? Have we got any baby dinosaurs or anything like that? Alright, go on then. Right, we've got any then. Well, we're in luck. It's the first crack. Cracked one off. Nah. Nothing very promising. Just a stone, isn't it? Just a bit of rock. Yeah, they're basically like little boat houses, aren't they? That boat's parked in there, look, in that little shack. Bladderack! Look, we found another bunker! Is that what it is, Matt? A bunker? What is it? Um, yeah, maybe they were for, you know, for good soldiers to shoot out of, look out of. Alright, boy! Anybody in here or what? Hang on, let me take a picture. Hang on. No. Oh, look, a little spy holes through. Oh, God, how cool is that? Yeah, get a picture of me in my bunker. Someone building a house there, got some scaffolding up. I don't know what they're doing. Looks like an abandoned house. You think we should try and get inside it? What do you reckon? 